A Stolen Childhood Understanding Child Marriage. Child marriage. Two words that should never go together. It is a harmful practice that robs children, especially girls, of their childhoods. Imagine being forced to marry before you even finish school, your dreams put on hold. This is the reality for millions of children around the world. Child marriage is a global issue that demands our attention. Child marriage is defined as any marriage where one or both partners are under the age of 18. It is a violation of human rights, denying children their right to education, health, and freedom of choice. The consequences are devastating, affecting not only the individual, but also their families and communities. We must remember that every child deserves a childhood, a chance to learn, grow, and reach their full potential. By understanding the issue of child marriage, we can work towards creating a world where every child is free to pursue their dreams. It is disheartening that child marriage is still legal in many countries. While some countries have set the minimum age for marriage at 18, others allow exceptions based on parental consent or religious practices. In some parts of the world, child marriage is more prevalent. Countries like Niger, Central African Republic, and Chad have the highest rates of child marriage. Girls as young as 12 or 13 are forced into marriage, often with much older men. This is unacceptable. Every child, regardless of where they are born, deserves protection from this harmful practice. We must work together to change laws and challenge cultural norms that perpetuate child marriage. While some countries have set the minimum age for marriage at 18, many allow exceptions. These exceptions often create loopholes that allow child marriage to continue. Some countries permit marriage below the minimum age with parental consent. This means that parents can essentially consent to their children's marriages, even if the child is not ready. Other exceptions are made in the name of religion or tradition. Some religious courts or authorities may allow marriages below the legal age, citing religious texts or customs. This is a clear violation of children's rights, as no religion should be used to justify harm. These exceptions and loopholes undermine the progress made in ending child marriage. We must strive for laws that are universally applied, protecting all children from this harmful practice. Section 4. The Devastating Impact The consequences of child marriage are far-reaching and devastating. Girls who are married young are more likely to experience domestic violence, abuse, and marital rape. Their health is also at risk, as they are more likely to face complications during pregnancy and childbirth. Education is another casualty of child marriage. Girls who are married young are often forced to drop out of school, limiting their future opportunities. This perpetuates a cycle of poverty and inequality, as these girls are denied the chance to reach their full potential. The impact of child marriage extends beyond the individual. It affects families, communities, and even national development. We must break this cycle and ensure that every child has the opportunity to thrive. Section 5. International Efforts and Hope for the Future The good news is that the world is waking up to the issue of child marriage. International organizations, governments, and civil society groups are working tirelessly to end this harmful practice. The United Nations has set a target of ending child marriage by 2030. Efforts are underway to raise awareness, strengthen laws and policies, and empower girls to say no to child marriage. Progress is being made, but there is still much work to be done. We must continue to advocate for the rights of children and ensure that every child can live a life free from violence and exploitation. Section 6, A Call for Change. Ending child marriage is everyone's responsibility. We must all raise our voices against this harmful practice and demand change. We can support organizations working to end child marriage, educate ourselves and others about the issue, and challenge cultural norms that perpetuate it. Let us remember that every child deserves a childhood, a chance to learn, grow, and pursue their dreams. Together, we can create a world where every child is free to reach their full potential, Let's work together to make child marriage a thing of the past.